Okay, hon. Just don't worry about it. Let let me deal with the wording. You just look pretty, okay? Okay, so... <laughs> That's a lie. Okay, so today was a productive day. Went to the con Philippine consulate to take care of some paperwork, then went over to the notary office to take care of same paperwork. Now, just trying to go into the uh, dental office here and see if my insurance with my company will cover me for cleaning and whatnot. I might need a few feelings as well, so yeah. Huh? What are you, what are you talking about? You don't, cut, you don't get that feeling from me? We need some other feelings. <laughs> See what I have to put up with. All right, let's go. Yeah, finally, pizza. So happy Wednesday everyone. So it's another day and we almost finished everything that we needed to get done. So we are now here at the pizza. Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut. So yay. I pleaded my husband to, you know, have another cheat day. But before that By cheat day she means every day. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway guys, we have, an, uh, we have a useful information for you that we're gonna share to you later. But first, we're gonna have to order food. Yes, we have to order food first, okay? So stay tuned. A few moments later. So we have our sweets now. So while waiting for the rest of the food. Yes, we actually have some useful information for you. Uh, if you are a foreigner and you are married to a Filipino or a Filipina, you don't have to go to the Macau consulate to get a notary or a counselorization when it comes to certain documents, especially pertaining to uh, real estate, like buying a condo or property. The reason why is apparently back in May 2019, the Philippine government has stated that they don't that people who are married to foreign citizens like myself, Filipino citizens that are married to foreigners, do not need to have a counselorization. All they need to do is go to the local government office and have the documents that we have here notarized by the local government here in Macau, and they will accept that. So that can save you quite a bit of money and time because if you go to the notary office here in Macau, you, you can get it done in one day, actually within like 30 minutes and your documents are done. Instead of the consulate where you have to wait three or four hours or a month or a week to get those documents. So that's very helpful, especially if you're purchasing property. But that's only pertaining to those who are married to foreigners. If you do not, if you do not have a Philippine passport, you can do this. You can just take those documents, get notarized. If you do, if both you and your husband or wife have Philippine passports, you can do the notar the notarization or counselorization at the Macau uh, uh, Macau Philippine consulate. So, a little bit of information to help you. Also, you don't do what we did, which is run around in circles trying to get this stuff done. So yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you. 
But yeah, Pizza Hut here in Macau is a lot different from the States. Ooh, pasta, baked, 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 baked. Yeah, the spinach, mushroom, and tomato. On the bright side, it's still healthy. Eh, not really, because of all the cream and uh, mm. oil and everything that's in there. But, you know, I guess it's healthy-ish. Alam nyo? Huh? Alam nyo guys, maraming kangkong sa likod ng bahay namin sa Pinas. Pwede pala ito, no? Kangkong pasta. Why not? No? Or as I like to say, Sige! Bahala ka! Mm. I want chicken, huh? No! Huh? You, you have enough, no. no. And besides, they already gave us the bill, so... No. Pizza without the chicken is nothing. Pizza without chicken. Yeah. So it's, it's just... It's always paired up. Just like you no. and me. We're always together. <laughs> what are you talking about? Mm. Sacrilege there. Pizza and chicken. Mm. No chicken. Well guys, I we hope you enjoyed that little video of, of going around Macau and having lunch together and getting our documents taken care of. So stick around and soon we'll be releasing part two of what? Of the places to visit here in Macau. Yes, so stay tuned to our channel, Team Pandaboo, and don't forget to Yay. hit that like. Team Pandaboo channel, so don't forget to hit like and subscribe. And that little bell icon somewhere around here to get notifications of when we release a new episode. So until next time, take care, everyone. Bye.